exploit kits are hidden all over the internet, and to the unprotected and uninformed user, it is possible to fall victim to the malicious payloads these kits hold. But what is an exploit kit? Well basically, they are like booby traps hidden on web pages. When a user visits a page that has an exploit kit trap loaded onto it, they will unknowingly be redirected to a series of URLs and finally, what we refer to as the landing page. The piece of the exploit kit that attacks the user's browser and web applications, like Internet Explorer or Java. Once the attack is completed, the exploit kit will load malicious software onto the system, installing it and infecting the user within minutes. The following is a demonstration of what happens to the system when a user loads a web page that has an exploit kit installed on it and how quickly the attack occurs from beginning to complete infection. Here we see an everyday system running a modern and common OS. The system includes multiple personal files, including important text documents and pictures. Pay special attention to the cute kitten photo. We'll see it again. Our users decide to find some soccer equipment online, so they do a simple search for a common seller nearby. They click the first link to check out the web page for Totally Soccer. By using the traffic analysis software known as Fiddler, we can track every move the exploit kit makes. The user is redirected, behind the scenes of course, twice. The first is to a domain called CozyComfort.com, and the next, the actual location of the exploit landing page. In this demonstration, we are dealing with the Rig Exploit Kit. As we study the network traffic, we can determine that there are three specific attacks in play against our web applications. Namely, CVE 2014-0322 for Internet Explorer, CVE 2014-0497 for Flash, and CVE 2013-2465 for Java. Finally, we find the call from the exploit kit to download the malicious software. After only 20 seconds from loading the web page, unbeknownst to the user, the exploit has executed the malware. In order to figure out what malware we are dealing with, we investigate the file dropped by the exploit kit. Using Process Explorer with a virus total plugin, we discover the drop file index1.php is a sparsely known malicious file, having been detected by only three of 53 antivirus scanners. The dropped file is working behind the scenes to install the malware. To get a closer look, we copy the file from its running location to the desktop. By giving the file a non-threatening name and extension, malware authors are able to hide the true intent of the binary. In this case, once renamed, our dropped file is unmasked as having a non-standard icon. An infection of the system is complete, and within a short time, our user is presented with an announcement from the malware. Your files are encrypted. As it turns out, the malware that the exploit kit installed is called CryptoWall, a ransom type malware, similar to CryptoLocker. As you can see, all of the user documents have been encrypted by the malware, including the cute kitten photo. The malware leads us to a site that demands $200 for the decryption of the files. Even if the user was to pay, promises made by cyber criminals should never be trusted. Attacks like this happen all the time and are a common way for cyber criminals to spread malware. That is where Malwarebytes Anti-Exploit comes in. Malwarebytes Anti-Exploit prevents the exploit attempt by identifying and blocking it at different layers. The exploit shellcode, the exploit payload, and the malicious action, which could be a malware executable, backdoor communication channel, aka reverse shell, or other forms of malicious action. Our next demonstration is the same case. However, this time, our user has installed Malwarebytes Anti-Exploit. The user searches for Totally Soccer once again and navigates to the page. We find the first URL redirection to CozyComfort.com, which means the next stop is the landing page. The exploit kit lands and attempts to drop the crypto wall malware onto the user system. And just when you think the user is going to lose their cute cat picture, Malwarebytes Anti-Exploit jumps into action. The software blocks the exploit attempt and informs the user that one had taken place. The user checks the anti-exploit logs to identify the exploit source as being Internet Explorer and hopefully won't try to visit that soccer store anymore. 
exploits are not a short-term problem. They are going to be around for a long time, just as they have already been a huge problem for users over the last few years. Applications are constantly being updated. In the meantime, a user can protect their system from not only rig and crypto wall, but an array of different exploit attacks, all by simply running Malwarebytes anti-exploit. Malwarebytes crushes malware, restores confidence.